Hey guys, today I am finally able to show you this literally game-breaking Viego bug, one of the worst bugs I have ever seen in League of Legends and the bug that is extremely easy to abuse in ranked. Do you guys remember my rel video, where by possessing rel and auto-attacking something, the game would crash? Well, this bug is at least 100 times worse. Under that Viego rel video, you guys were asking what's next? Viego stealing League of Legends exe or Viego stealing Summoner's Rift? Well, you guys were actually right, you guys jinxed it, cause this is what this bug is about. Just few hours after posting that real video, I was informed about this new Viego Anivia bug that basically makes the game disappear, but like completely disappear. It's gone, as you guys can see right now. And the best, or maybe I should say the worst part about it, is that you can do it with an ally, and that's what makes it so abusable. But how does it work? How did Artenis even find out about it? Well, this is actually a clip of him having this bug for the first time, but randomly. He chases Viego, he walls him off, and then, yeah, he's attempting to reconnect, but the game is gone, completely gone, too little too late. Fascinated by this bug, together with his friends, he actually managed to reproduce it. And you can see, for example, him reproducing it near the blue buff. But it was a tricky position to do it in, and it turns out you can do this bug basically every single time in that wall near Raptors, where the bug originally happened. It's extremely simple, you all decide like here, Viego uses his E like this, and the game is gone, gone forever. So if you played versus Viego and Danivia, or Viego and someone else in the past days, and the game disappeared, well, you know what happened. Here is another example. They were just playing a game, enemies weren't the nicest, and then accident happened and the game was gone forever. So after we already knew it works with Anivia, I decided to try it some other champions. And guess what? They also worked. We tried Talia, succeeded first time. We also succeeded with Trundle, although this one is a bit harder because the pillar isn't as wide as the wall. And as you can see in all of these clips, there is a wall near Viego, Viego uses E, and then game cannot handle it, it is too much for the game, you get attempting to reconnect, but then when you quit the game, you are back to lobby because the game is gone. You check much history and nothing is there. So that was an absolutely terrible exploit. The bug was so bad that it couldn't even get hotfixed. Riot needed a proper patch and redeployed to be able to fix it. I personally reported it to Riot August and then him and his colleagues managed to find a fix for it. So as it stands now, it seems that the bug is gone and everything is fine. But one more thing, Vanderl. Did you see 11.3 patch notes? There wasn't a single Viego bug fix. Well, Riot probably fixed like 50 Viego bugs this patch, but I guess why would it even be mentioned in there? Who cares? Yet again a lot of shadow changes, and not gonna lie, this is pretty frustrating. But what can I do about it? Riot, please document your fixes and changes. Thank you, it would help everyone, really. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please tell me in comments what do you think about this gigantic spaghetti. Hope you enjoyed and hope you don't think that Viego is still inferior to old Mordekaiser. Cause this dude, he delivers every single day. Take care guys and have a good day.